Hello, and welcome to an emergency breaking update edition of WatchGuard Security Week in Review. I'm your host, Corey Nockreiner. Early Monday, WatchGuard's live security analyst team identified a very concerning uh, cross-platform computer virus spreading uh, throughout devices of all types. It infects uh, Mac and Windows PCs, mobile devices, and has even carried over to household devices like uh, IP refrigerators, microwaves, and uh, coffee makers. This malware seems to be spreading through North America and Europe like wildfire and is just now hitting computers in Australia and the Asia Pacific region. We're calling this malware ByteMarks since it seems to arrive as an attachment called ByteMarks.exe, which comes as either an email, uh, instant messenger file, or sometimes as a file posted on a social network. Once bite marks infects one of your computing devices, its response time significantly slows down. On top of that, it begins to pursue a relentless and seemingly insatiable campaign to start to zombify other devices with the bite marks infection. Some other symptoms of this serious infection include your device may spontaneously restart after you've shut it down or even after you've unplugged it. Uh, your device's sleep or hibernation modes will no longer work. Uh, some of your documents will be renamed to brains and their contents will become indecipherable. Uh, your browser may be redirected to the Walking Dead website. Some of the icons on your desktop and the emoticons you use on social networks will have a green tinge and might appear to be somewhat bloodthirsty. And you'll also notice some unusual sound files on your computing device as well. So far, no one has figured out how to clean the infection. It seems to be very resilient. The only way to get rid of it is to try to destroy the device that's infected with this malware. Of course, some users have learned the hard way that simply destroying parts of the device is not enough. You have to go for the brain or the CPU on your device. And if you're using a dual CPU or a multi-CPU device, be careful because there's lots of CPUs to kill. So far, our live security experts are still unsure of the origin of this particular malware. Uh, we seem to believe it's some sort of mutated rabies virus that has done an unholy union with some very, very powerful malware. We're still researching it, but it seems to have affected 38% of the computing devices in the United States. So it's a very, very critical uh, threat. Now the good news is, if your organization is protected by one of those red unified threat management systems, those systems have the multiple layers of defense or the defense in depth capabilities that seem to be immune from this particular infection. So any devices behind those are fine and good to go. If you don't already have a UTM appliance protecting your organization, we urge you to obtain one immediately before serious malware like bite marks zombifies your computing devices, creating a network apocalypse. We'll be sure to update you if there's any significant developments to this story. In the meantime, stay frosty out there and thank you for watching. Here at WatchGuard, we'd like to sincerely wish you a happy April Fool's Day.